I have my coffee. I know, Starbucks is basic. But you know what, I like the taste of it. And I was gonna go to Alfred's, but it was too far. And I had to drop off my friend Chrissy this morning at our class. Rose? I'm texting Rose, she should come downstairs and make an appearance in the video, but. All right, so to start off, I am going to take my witch hazel that I'm literally almost out of. I use the Thayer's Natural Remedies Astringent Witch Hazel Aloe Vera Formula. So this is what I use. I heard a little bit about it, I heard it's really good for your skin, so I just decided to bring, or just, I decided to buy it. Um, and I think it's been working. It's supposed to tighten your pores and you know, I don't like seeing my pores, so I figure why not try it out. So I just rub this all over my face. It's also good, like I'll use it at night. I'll use it really anytime, just when I wanna like refresh my face when I don't have makeup on. So this is the Waso by Shishido Ginza Tokyo. This is the moisturizer and it's so amazing. It's basically like a gel base and it's really soft. Influencer actually sent this to me, which was really sweet. Okay, now I'm going to take this Evian Brew, I'm not even gonna try to say it, facial spray. And I'm basically just gonna spray this. So I wanna update you guys because I am in LA for the summer and I'm doing an internship and I'm here with all my best friends and we're all living together and it's so much fun and it's just weird to me that I'm here because ever since I was five years old I've always wanted to just live in LA I remember dreaming when I was little I always wanted to be on Disney Channel I used to audition for them when I was younger and it was just like my dream to live out here but I will say it's you know it's very different than I would have imagined. Um, you know, it's really cool. You know, there's Hollywood Boulevard and everything, what everyone thinks of when they think of LA, but you know, I actually don't even like to go in those areas. It's kind of like Times Square with New York City. Like it's all touristy and you know, it's not like real LA. Um, but since I've been here, I've gone to Marina Del Rey, Venice, Malibu, which was really beautiful. We went hiking there and the beach there is gorgeous. Oh, also this is the, this is the, oh God, it like rubbed off. What is this? Oh, the It, It Cosmetics Full Coverage Anti-Aging Waterproof Concealer. I love this too, but it's kind of sticky, so I only use a little bit. Um, but yeah, I've gone to so many places in LA and I've really been enjoying it, but I still can't decide if I wanna live here or in New York because, you know, I'm an East Coast girl and I love New York so much. So I don't really know where I'll end up. And you know, all my family's in New Jersey and I'm really close with my family, so. Also, I miss my grandma so much since I've been here. Like, I mean, I text her like all the time, but I've been sending her so many pictures and I'm so jealous because my sister's like always with her and like she'll bring her friends to my grandma's house and I'm like, I miss my grandma. <laughs> um, but yeah, I love my grandma. We're like best friends. Um, right now I'm just gonna go in with that bronzer. I'm gonna go in with this NARS cream blush in the shade Orgasm. I'm also just gonna set that with this, it's like a bronzer highlight and blush in one. It's in the shade Dark to Deep and it's from Bare Minerals. Also, you can see I'm using my Beauty Blender for literally everything. And the secret, not the secret. The reason why I'm doing that is because before I came to LA like six months, or not six months, six weeks ago, I was like, oh, I'm gonna clean my brushes and then I'll, you know, bring them to LA. And um, I think this is, no, this is not all of them, but I have a, like a whole bag like this of brushes that I haven't cleaned and I refuse to put them on my face because I don't want to get more acne. So 
Hopefully I, I get around to washing those. This is also from NARS. It's in the shade Copacabana. I'm just gonna like put it on my fingers though, like this. It's a really pretty shade, if you can see that. Um, and I kind of just like pat it. Again, this is cream, so I feel like it just melts into my skin so seamlessly. At least it looks good on camera, so. <laughs> And then I'll do like a little bit on my nose. Your big bow. I do that under here too. I don't, I don't know. I just do that. Sometimes I actually put it on my eyelids. Um, but I think I'm going to do actual eyeshadow today. So I don't think I will. I recently have been using my Too Faced Sweet Peach palette. And I've been using the shade Luscious up here. But I kind of want to try something new. Oh, this is my sister's. It's a Tarte palette. Um, it's called Rainforest of the Sea Volume 3. Um, yeah, this is my sister's. I stole it. I don't think she knows, so don't tell her. I don't think she watches my videos. So, so I'm going to put on some eyeshadow. I'm going to start out with the shade Tiki because this is the only matte shade actually in this entire palette. I'm just going to put this all over my lid. Oh, Rachel just texted me. Hi, Rachel. Hi, Sam, if you're watching this. My best friend is from Elon. Um, okay, now I'm going to use... I don't know if I want to use Jewel or Malibu. Jewel. It's like kind of like a lighter, bronzy shade right here. I'm going to put that in my crease. Even though it's sparkly, I don't really follow the rules. Like with transition colors sometimes, I just do whatever I want. I wish I knew the words to this. Thank you, Kane. I gotta put on a song I do now. I'm really not the best at filling in my eyebrows, if you can tell. Um, I probably should watch some videos, but I hate when beauty gurus are, you know, filming and they're doing their brows and then they're like, Actually, I'm gonna do this off camera. It's like, no girl, I need help. I don't know how to do my brows. Like I really need help. Um, I've tried so many brow things, but I think my favorite overall is like the brow powder from European Wax Center. Like hands down, I think it's just, the powder just works better for me, I guess. Um, but yeah, that's just, that's just me. Um, my hair is a mess. Look great. This is one of my favorite mascaras. It's the L'Oreal Paris Telescopic Mascara, and it's so cheap. I just get it at like CVS, and I love how skinny the wand is. Do you guys remember this song? Oh my god, I used to listen to this over and over and over again. Oh, oh my god, I look like I'm gonna break my neck. <laughs> the other day I was putting this on, and then I sneezed twice. Let me tell you, it's not pretty. I just got mascara all under my eyes. Oh my God, why? I used to always do my eye makeup before I did my face makeup. Why don't I do that anymore? I used to always do that for dance competitions because I would always get fallout. I don't know why I don't do that anymore. All right, so I'm just gonna curl my hair now. I use the Hot Tools. It's like the, I think, three quarters of an inch slash one inch wand. I had this before, but I had to get another one because when I went to France, I went to plug it in and it completely like blew a fuse and didn't work anymore. So it's kind of upsetting. Um, so I bought another one. Apologies, I don't know what's wrong with my camera, but it's not letting me film, but I'm almost done with this video, so I'm just putting in this dry shampoo. It's the Dove one, it's the coconut scent. I just spray this everywhere, I use it like every single day. 
caught it in my mouth. So yeah, this is my final look. I hope you guys enjoyed getting ready with me this morning. So that's basically, you know, my summer makeup routine. You know, sometimes we'll do a little bit more makeup, sometimes a little bit less, and sometimes no makeup at all. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please comment down below um, your makeup faves and your summer music playlist because I'd love to listen to it. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.